this far. It's already been two and a half years since we met. Back then, you were in the media's attention as a young politician who could rise up against bureaucracy. Akechi first, like, confronted Shido and they met when Akechi gained the power of Persona, right? I'm pretty sure that's mentioned later in the game at some point or something like that, or I just made it up in my head. But, um... So a half a year... It's been half a year since I got my powers. So two years before Akira became a Phantom Thief, Akechi was already having his persona and going and doing stuff in the metaverse and all that for two years straight until the Phantom Thief started to exist. That means Akechi... Akechi is Makoto's age, right? A year older than me, so he's like 17 or 18. So uh, Akechi has been doing this since he was like 15. Like as old as Kasumi is now, I guess. Because of that, those who wanted to preemptively deal with problems tried to tie you up in scandal. To think I would fall for the ruse schemed by those decrepit fools in power. I recall that's when you came to me. You promoted yourself saying you had special powers. If it wasn't for the research on cognition that I dabbled in, I would have thought you insane. I made those troublesome opponents psychotic and erased any trace of that scandal. Who'd think that tampering with a person's heart could trigger a psychotic lapse or mental shutdown? And when someone like that said he'd support me, I had suspected there'd be an ulterior motive. It's because I sympathized with your aspiring ideology. I believed that your ideals needed to be achieved for the sake of the country's future. Well, my faith in you was precisely why I pulled the plug on that research. I only need you using that power. It'd be troublesome if someone else uncovered how it works. Wakaba Ishiki, was it? That researcher. She wouldn't have had to die if she just complied. Any suspicions should be snubbed out. Even the smallest doubt must be severed at the root. After all, we had an active public prosecutor's office director on our side until recently. Astounding, isn't it? To think the director himself often forged evidence to secure his promotion. He was quite surprised when you confronted him about it. He didn't know who leaked that information. Well, I got that out of his shadow, so technically speaking, he did it himself. This country's affairs have become stagnant. The political world is filled with old men who only act to preserve their own vested interests. The general public has forsaken such political affairs and don't even bother. Oh. Um, I must agree. Whoops, misclick. The general public has forsaken such political affairs and don't even bother. Only ruin awaits us. There's no need to be ruined along with such incompetent fools. I will lead this country to its revival. Those who get in the way must be eliminated at times. That's the correct way to use the metaverse. Still, it would stand out if there were continuous deaths and scandals with your political rivals. Which is why I made them suspects. Prosecute the targets that I turn psychotic, and solve them as cases unrelated to you. And thus, the charismatic Ace Detective was born. Thanks to your efforts, my clean image remains untarnished, and I've monopolized public opinion. <laughs> Once I gained public sentiment, collaborators from all sectors began approaching me on their own. The police were no exception. With their management in my pocket, keeping them in check was easy. When the Phantom Thieves emerged, I thought things might become somewhat troublesome. And they were just brats once we looked into it. All we needed to do was lay the blame on them. When you told me that, I knew then that you were the better man. Their popularity was a bit beyond my expectations. But flipping it made the negative press stronger. After that, all I had to do was openly berate them. I've been gaining more supporters since. The current administration is dead with ongoing scandals. 
Never mind the fact that they're my doing. Even the government parties have begun splitting up, and they're dissolving just as planned. <laughs> the time has finally come. Just a little more, and I will take the seat of Prime Minister. However, inauguration isn't my goal. That's when everything truly begins. I'll make this country rich for the sake of its selfish and ignorant masses who can only rely on others. In other words, you're creating a powerful country that can compete with the world. The public resonates with my ideals and follows me. And for that, some sacrifices can't be avoided. That is my duty as the chosen one. Your assistance has been very influential in making my plans proceed smoothly. When I become Prime Minister, I'll grant whatever wish you want. With this most recent case, my name has become known across the country. Perhaps even the world. Surely my story will be passed down as a hero who won against monsters that could control people's hearts. I believe I'll lay low and devote myself to my studies. I suppose with your age, you wouldn't come up with debauched desires. I am thinking about the future, though. Well, uh, how do I put this? Looks like things have finally settled down. All the cutscenes are about over. Life's gonna get real busy for you starting tomorrow, right? Get some rest? Actually, I don't have to go to school. It seems like life is gonna get really not busy. Well then. Chief's right, let's take it easy for today. Hey. Hey, another box came for you. Yes! 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 At long last, he's done it. There is nothing else that can possibly be done other than this. Why is the captain badge new? I've had that for ages. Where's the thing? The salvation crown. It takes 48 SP to use this skill. Fully restores HP and cures non-special ailments for all allies. Healer Ryuji will rise! He will rise. Oh man. But you got a you got a chakra choker? You can you can take the ring of lust. Everyone needs a ring. Except for Ryuji. Ryuji gets the crown, I get a mirror. Coffee Daddy. No, say best for last. So worst first. At any rate, I'm glad you're back safe and sound. But even that's putting it too lightly. You had it rough in there, didn't you? Only a little. Sorry. Ketchu was after you all along. I knew it was risky, but we had no choice but to depend on him. Thanks to your tenacity, you were able to fool him. It's payback time. Let's make him regret underestimating the Phantom Thieves. Remember how I hijacked your phone during the school trip? That kind of came in handy. How so? Well, remember how I put that wiretap app in Akechi's phone? Basically, that let me see GPS info for two phones, yours and his. I'd be able to tell the precise moment Sai Nijima, who had your phone, ran into a catchy. That's when I saw my chance, and beep, sent the signal to activate the Metaverse Navigator. But there was a chance they'd just pass each other without saying a single word. <laughs> That's why we needed you to tell Sai Nijima to show the phone to a catchy. This plan still surprises me no matter how many times I hear it. You and me both, Cat. Still, I couldn't just directly hack into the Metaverse nav. It's a mysterious app after all. But you know how it has that bookmark function? All you have to do is push the button. Making the phone think he was pushing that button was totally doable. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? What do you mean making the phone think a catchy press the button? What? You know what? I don't even want to talk about it. So. Oh, by the way, police report on your death isn't going to show up at your school. No need to worry. Seems Prosecutor Nijimo worked out some kind of deal with the higher-ups or something. I mean, they haven't even said anything to me, even. As long as you stay quiet, you'll be fine. Well, and I guess I if they reported your death now, they'd basically be saying you were a phantom thief. Can't really go announcing what the phantom thieves are, so I'm sure they'll avoid it. Alright, everyone get out of my room. I'm going to I'm bed. Head back then. Guess I'll head home. Go to bed, alright? Yeah, sleep. Guess he won't be going to school for a while. Hooray! Don't worry about it. This will be a breeze compared to what we've had to face so far. And we'll have all the time to come up with the plans together. To be perfectly honest, 
I don't really care what happens to Shido, one way or the other. But when I consider the fact that he's your enemy, I naturally think he's my enemy as well. I'm going to stay with you until the very end. Well then, we should get to sleep. Nighty-night. You know, something that Futaba said before, when you were in a pinch in the palace, she picked up a reading of someone who came to your rescue. Was that... Oh yeah, are, like, are we finally gonna get Kasumi to like join us for Shido's palace? Or do you literally not get to use Kasumi at all except for the very final new palace they added in the game? It was Kasumi. So it was Yoshizawa. Then we'd better let her know you're safe now. And I'll even lend you a hand with that. She probably thinks I'm dead, right? Apparently, Akechi arrested the leader of the Phantom Thieves. He's a hero. So glad Akechi's back. Hope they can catch the rest of the Phantom Thieves, too. He really is amazing. There's no point in even having an election. Shido's gonna win. Yeah, that's not how democracy works, though. Of course, he's the only reliable politician there is. Have you not heard of my boy, Broshida? Chosen by Lord Escanor himself. Plus, the current government has been getting wrapped up in scandal after scandal. I recognize this voice actor. Even more importantly, there's just an aura about him. Like he can fix whatever problems we have. This is Kobayakawa, isn't it? This is the principal who died. Even more importantly, there's just an aura about him. Yeah, it's the same guy. Honestly, it doesn't really matter to me who does it. I just want to see our society back on track. Especially after it turned out those phantom thieves were nothing more than scum in the end. I'll show you. Heard you went home, so I announced it during homeroom. Are you okay? I am, thanks. You're alive. The news is reporting you committed suicide. Call me when you can. I was so confused. But as long as you're safe. Don't worry about school. Just take care of yourself. Hard. Is it true that the leader of the Phantom Thieves died? How could the police let him commit suicide in jail? They need to get their stuff together. Cut that out. Quiet down. You're in class. Break's been over for quite some time now. Swear you're like monkeys in a zoo? Huh. Oh, yeah. I received... Oh, my goodness, something in my throat. I received word from Caruso's family that will be absent for a bit. Jeez, what do you people think school is anyway? It's almost time. If you look at the TV on December 7th and December 12th, you will get references to things. Okay. I don't think we'll get to the 7th or 12th today, so you're going to have to remind me again. Hey, it can't be true, can it? Please tell me you're okay. All good. Oh, thank goodness you're safe. That suicide report was all over the news, and Miss Kawakami said you went back to your hometown. I was honestly worried about con contacting you. Words. Even Sakamoto was dodging the question when I tried to ask him. But don't worry, I won't tell anyone. By the way, the fan side is a real mess right now, but I'll keep supporting you from the shadows. Good luck. Hey. Imagine if he threw the chalk it on, if the teacher had. That'd be amazing. Don't need to worry about it in here, but try not to do anything to draw attention. Anyway, today's a day off, so eat your curry and take it easy. You can take your time with it, too. It's not like any customers are going to be showing up. Okay. Let's try and think of the keyword once the chief's curry has energized you. Have you guys figured out the keyword to Shido's Palace yet? I've tried all sorts of stuff, but no luck so far. It's hard to understand the thought process of a criminal mastermind like him. You know, I've been wondering if he's been behind all those mental shutdowns. Doesn't that mean all the weird accidents from these past few years were his fault? Like that subway accident back in April. Now that you mention it, that accident lost the Minister of Transport his job. Wait, are you trying to say Shido caused that accident? 
But it's the subway. Does he not care at all about innocent lives? This man seems to be truly unbelievable. Supposedly, there are still tons of victims from that in the hospital even now. Masayoshi Shido. How many has he killed over the years? How could we ever understand what goes on in the mind of such a horrible man? Hey, wouldn't it be faster if we just go there and try and think about it on site? Let's try that. If we're going to go, I'd like a Kirakun to join, but... Will that be okay? Won't somebody spot him there? Yeah, we'll probably figure out the keyword in no time once we're there. Plus, I can throw off anyone who tails us with my blazing speed. What, are you going to pick everyone else up and carry them? All right, let's have a Kirakun join us then. Remember, though, we're going with the intent of not being seen. It'll be very, very convincing that we're not guilty of anything when a cop walks up to us and then Ryuji just bolts. Okay. Well, let's meet in front of the Diet Building and force that scum's palace open. All right. Let's head to the Diet Building. Make sure you aren't discovered, okay? I'll do what I want. That's the plan. You gotta be kidding me. You realize you're done for if you get caught, right? Well, yeah, it's been that way the entire time. Ugh. <sighs> the stunts you pull sometimes. Just don't stay out too late. I realize you're dead now, but you still have a curfew. Okay, she isn't here. Let's begin at once. Police cars are making rounds, so we can't stay here too long. We already have Masayo Shishido and Diet Building. All we need is what he thinks of this place. Maybe Mount Fuji, since it's the highest place in the country? Conditions have not been met. What about a mansion? Yo, it would be wild if one of the palaces was literally just a friggin' mountain. Since he's met. going to subjugate everyone as prime minister, perhaps a school? What about an arena, like the Colosseum? Imperial been Palace? Conditions have not been met. It's no good. I thought we would have gained entry by now. Maybe we shouldn't have called you here. Hey, you think he's guarding his whole palace with a barrier? What? Shido stole the cognitive science research, right? Well, maybe it had some special move written in it. Is that even possible? Who knows? I've got no idea. There was nothing like that in the notes I saw. Anyways, what kind of person is Shido? I can't figure him out. I did some light research on him last night, but I couldn't get a grasp on the type of man he is. Over there is probably a legislator, right? I'll try asking him. Excuse me, I'm a member of the newspaper club at my high school. May I speak with you for a moment? Sure. What kind of person is Representative Shido? What's he think about the national diet? His stance is dedication for country, it's how he's garnered everyone's trust. He's an admirable man of action, with a first-class determination. I'd say he's a model politician. I believe that he'll help create a wonderful future in which young adults like you can live in ease. An exemplary answer. It makes sense he wouldn't tell teenagers anything unnecessary. Look over there. He's on a walkie-talkie. Wait, is it about us? Attention, sir. There are some teenagers being teenagers down here. Do I have permission to shoot? That doesn't look good. We should leave at once. Tomorrow's a day off, so let's have an early strategy meeting. Meet at LeBlanc, okay? We should all think about this tonight. We in this. 